Rita Collins with us here, Scranton Prep. Uh, we're just talking a little bit about your sports, mm -hmm. uh, track and field and soccer uh, and basketball. So all those different yeah. sports, but you're a really good student. <laughs> That's really what matters. Uh, but you're really good at, at athletics as well. But let's, let's talk about the, the studies first. You're going to go to Villanova, mm -hmm. um, which is incredible. It's not easy Thank to get you. to Villanova. So talk about that accomplishment. Yeah, I mean, I try to balance my sports in my school as much as I can. It's been difficult throughout the past four years, but I worked really hard. I studied really hard, so I'm truly happy I get the opportunity to go to, go to a school like that. Let's talk about finding your own identity. Obviously, uh -huh. you and your sister are close, Yeah. Uh, but, you know, everybody's got their own little things. Uh -huh. She's totally into basketball, playing at Bucknell, very successful. Mm -hmm. And for you, you've been successful at whatever you've done, yeah. but now you're just going to take a an academic path at, at right. Villanova. Yeah, um, I mean, I kind of like growing up um, in my sister's footsteps. My older sister plays soccer at NYU, and my sister plays basketball at Bucknell. Um, so I kind of took my own route running track, and I've really liked it, and I've been fairly successful. So I think that's kind of like the way I've kind of broken out of like kind of being in their shadow a little bit. But I honestly don't feel like that. Like we do our own stuff, you know. We're into our own things, and we all like, support each other through that. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about the, the pressure. I'm sure uh -huh. in track and field, there's probably a little bit more pressure because oh, it's yeah. individualized. Yeah, talk about yeah, that. it definitely is. Um, I mean, obviously, we do some team events, some relays and things like that, but to be in those individual events and those big meets, there is a lot of pressure on you, and to kind of help my team and get those points to win that meet, that's where the pressure kind of comes. Let's talk about basketball and you know your skill set out there. You know what mm -hmm. you try to do for your team and be a yeah. leader as a senior. Um, I kind of have grown in the program as a hustle player, as getting those rebounds and the steals. Um, this year, I've been a little bit more offensive-minded, just because we did graduate those seniors who were really played really well offensively. So I kind of have thought more about my offense. Um, I really try to get rebound. Like that's my biggest thing. I try to get rebounds for my team, kick it out, get girl shots. Um, so I think I kind of improved my game in that this year. Um, and uh, like aggressive, I'm really aggressive on the defensive end and in our press, so I think that helps a lot too. You, you got to take a little bit out of every coach you've had. Uh -huh. Coach Pavilion has been part of your life, so right. what do you take out of him as life lessons? That I'm sure you know he does academics, teaches right. some great mm -hmm. stuff at prep, but he's also the basketball coach. Right, he's helped me a lot with my balance with school and um, sports. He's kind of helped me guide how I want, like how do I practice and how do I study and all that kind of stuff. I mean, he obviously taught me everything I know for basketball. So to be under him and have him as my coach has really been a privilege. Let's talk about the support, the family, mm -hmm. everybody into, you know, hey, let's let's go accomplish this academically yeah. and let's go have some fun athletically. Yeah, I feel like my, fam well, my family's always had my back and all my sister's back. Um, and to have them by my side through this has been incredible. They've pushed me academically and athletically. Um, my sisters and my parents have been with me throughout everything I've been through. So to have them, especially for the senior season, um, and like in the arena and those big games, it's just great to have them there and supporting me. You're going to play a, a home uh, yep, game? Yeah, home, home state playoff game. So uh, talk about your, your emotions that will go through you as a senior and just like, hey, this, yeah. you know, we get this opportunity, let's try to make the most of it. Yeah, we're really happy we had a home state playoff game. It's really nice to um, be able to play on our court one last time. Playing in there, it's just, it's the greatest feeling ever, um, and having that opportunity is so great. So we're really, really excited for Saturday and to be able to play in our gym. How about memories in general as a student athlete at Scranton Prep? Yeah. A lot of tradition, a lot of people that go on to do incredible things. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so great to just have the opportunity to even go to prep, um, and let alone be involved in all these sports. I've made so many friends and have so many memories since my time here. Um, and to be involved in these type of programs that are just so successful and just like to have teammates like I do, it's been incredible. Well, uh, it's great to hear your story and you still have a lot more to be written in Villanova. We wish you the very best. Thank you.